Yeah, uh, coach always tells me there's two things that are non-negotiables with me is just don't go out and uh, make mistakes, which is just play um, as hard as I can. And every time, even if it's just for one possession, two possessions, you know, try to win those possessions. Um, every time I'm out there and then when I come out, you know, just be ready to go back in. And then just bring emotion and energy and uh, just try to help whatever I can do to help my team win. And is it for you to go from scout team to obviously kind of getting some minutes now and obviously kind of contributing to this team now? Um, it's definitely a dream come true. You know, it's what I grew up wanting to do is play basketball, um, college basketball. It makes it even better that I have teammates like Deshaun that are just great and a coach like Coach Beard that believes in me and uh, definitely gives me the chance to prove myself whenever I can. What did you see from your teammates uh, Monday where you guys kind of bounced back after that loss? Uh, saw a lot of smiles. Definitely, um, we were in a better mood, you know, because we played up to our capabilities and we can always get better. But everyone was smiling and uh, having fun and, you know, playing together and being a team. So, Sean, I guess for, from your perspective, I guess what, what do you kind of see from Avery every time he's on the court? Um, he's, a, he's a great teammate. He's always hard working. He go out there and play hard. He makes other people want to play hard. And um, he just go out there and just do everything he can for the team. I guess from your perspective, what, what have you done to kind of get yourself kind of back in a rhythm? I know obviously the injury kind of slowed you down a little bit, but it seems like you're kind of getting back into your ways. Um, nothing really. Uh, just like I, I tell every uh, every time we have a press conference, I tell everybody do the same thing. I just go out there and perform to my best abilities and go out there and um, just try to get the win for our team. Let me ask the same questions. It gets a little frustrating, though. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I'm sure you hear it when you're on the court, uh, but you have a lot of uh, crowd support behind you. Uh, just how does it feel to have the fans really back you up? Uh, feels really good. Uh, makes me smile. Uh, you know, definitely it's different because normally, you know, it's all for Jared or for Deshaun. But, um, you know, it, it just uh, it's a good feeling, I guess. Are you mentally, is it easy for you to kind of just embrace your role, not try to do too much when you're out there on the court? Um, for sure. Uh, I was raised, you know, just to work hard. And when you work hard, a lot of stuff falls in place by itself. And definitely that's one of the easier things I have to do is just work hard because uh, I was raised into it. And when Coach Beard asked me just to work hard, it just I can just do it, I guess. Deshaun, talk about taking uh, – Taking advantage of the opportunities and how the, is the game slowing down for you? Or are you when shots it just seem to be falling? Um, I think uh, Coach Bill just put me in positions to uh, just perform uh, well on the court. I, I don't think like uh, I, I I honestly just think I'm just going out there, just playing my role and just doing what I have to do to, for us to win. That's all. And, and Avery, uh, talk, talk about being a facilitator and a team leader on the court, especially when the, the younger players come uh, on and you're there leading for this team? Um, for sure, when I'm with them, just try to do my best to uh, keep things flowing smoothly. Um, you know, I'm not the offensive threat when I'm out on the court, but I do have responsibilities to keep everything moving smoothly and try to do the best that I can. And when those guys come in, it's just try to do the same thing, but get them to play hard and, you know, get them, you know, some time and get them ready to play some games when their time comes.